perfect, nice and happy. We've got the... Just, uh... It's been fantastic, you know, not only, you know, physically, you know, am I refreshed with getting over a lot of injuries that I've had in the last couple of years, but also mentally just getting away from the game, being able to travel, spend time with family, um, just get away from rugby. Uh, been playing for, it's my 12th season this year, so it's been really refreshing, but at the same time I'm looking forward to getting home, you know, stepping up my training and, you know, getting back into playing again. Still a lot of work to do. It's going to be, you know, extremely uh, challenging you know, thing to do. There's a, a reason why it's so tough, and, and no team has, has ever won two World Cups in a row. So that's the challenge uh, that's ahead of us, and, and one we'd we'd love to, I guess, love to do. But um, you know, we're going to have to just keep growing as a team. But you know, I couldn't think of uh, you know. Better moment and you know, travelling to, to London and, and winning the World Cup again, but um, still a lot of time, a, a lot of work, a lot of competition uh, that's to come in front of us. You know, before we get to that stage, they're a huge threat, and you know they've shown what they're capable of. You know, the last couple of times we played them at Twickenham, so they'll be a huge threat. You know, Ireland are really growing and, and performing well. You know, the Welsh are always going to be there or thereabouts. Um, can't forget, you know, the Southern Hemisphere sides. You know, with South Africa and, and Australia, you know, we play them a lot each year, and you know they uh, they love you know World Cups as you know, as much as we do. So um, you know they'll they'll be running right contention, and obviously our bogey team France that uh, come World Cup time, um, you yeah, know, love playing the All Blacks.